We're keeping pace with NASA as it prepares to launch its next major Earth and climate science satellite. So the Plankton Aerosol Cloud Ocean Ecosystem Mission, or PACE, is set for liftoff tomorrow morning from Kennedy Space Center. NASA Earth Science Division Director Karen St. Germain joined us live from the launch site this morning. Karen, good morning. Good morning, it's great to be with you. Ah, it's great to have you. NASA is just hours away from this launch. Can you tell us more about this mission? Yeah, we are so excited about the PACE launch. PACE is going to use that unique vantage point of space to study very, very tiny things that have an enormous impact. In our oceans, we will be looking at phytoplankton. These are microalgae that are at the base of our food chain. And in the atmosphere, we'll be looking at tiny particles called aerosols that come from things like dust blowing off the Sahara or wildfires or even human activities. In both cases, with phytoplankton and aerosols, they play a huge role in the stability of our climate, but also in the quality of our lives day to day. And this is incredible to think about what this mission is going to do. So how is uh, this going to benefit our community? Well, in many ways, this will benefit our communities. With, uh, with the oceans, phytoplankton are at the base of the food chain, so they're really important for the ocean economy, which is a $350 billion a year sector of our, our economy in the U.S. But they can also be toxic. And in that case, we, our coastal communities can suffer adverse impacts. And with the aerosols, uh, they seed storms hurricanes that can can uh, that come across the Atlantic, but they also affect air quality. And that means people who have asthma want to know what's, what is in the air that they're breathing. So there are many, many aspects of this mission that will have direct real-time impact on our lives. We need to do more research on that, especially here locally. We deal with a lot of that. All right, King Aaron St. Germain, uh, live from Kennedy Space Center. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Guys, isn't it incredible to think about how that is going to impact the data that we collect? So mm -hmm. I'm excited about this launch tomorrow morning. Especially the components she talked about with asthma just now. I know, and the allergies mm -hmm. here. We need more research, more data. So hopefully this will help us out here in Houston. All right.